like that. Kevin Cosner was on and he said to me he was very nervous and he came out and he was very nervous to be there. And then he started telling stories and I just didn't want it to end. I remember one of my friends was a, was a writer and, and of course I sent him on a lot of, you know, jobs and, and every report that came back was he just pissed everybody off. And finally he came over and he goes, you know, I hate Hollywood, I hate all you people. And he went down to Arizona and he was working in a Chinese restaurant. If you've ever worked in a Chinese restaurant, washing dishes, there's a lot of them. <laughs> he said, have you read what I wrote? I said, no, I, 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 don't, I, I don't really like you anymore. And he goes, well, I'm cold. I'm working at this place and I'm having to kill raccoons and work at this Chinese restaurant. <laughs> and, and, uh, and I said, so I, I sent him a sleeping bag. I sent him stuff. And, and he said, did, did you read what I, and finally I read it and um, it was Dances with Wolves. No. He, uh, oh. I mean, I could have just sat there and just listened to him talk, just honestly and truthfully and about his great life. <laughs> It's amazing to go from killing raccoons and washing dishes to winning was, an Oscar. Yeah. It was already amazing before the punchline that yeah, you wrote. Yes, it was it's like, I never help people. <laughs> <laughs> no point, no point. <laughs> 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 <laughs>